Uh, welcome back guys. So today I just wanted to show you a little bit of some things which I've done in Smedit. It's Smedit Sunday and every Sunday I do something with Smedit so this time I decided to return to the original model made by Ilsteer in 2009. It's on the uh, 3D SketchUp warehouse, the link is in the description for this video. Um, credit where credit is due, this guy must have spent hours creating all of these poses from the model which he's obviously created himself. So these are all the Gundam RX-78-2 and I've got six different poses here and uh, I've basically taken the model through um, through Smedit without using Binbox. This was done completely in Smedit um, and effectively I've gone through each of the poses instead of just the one that I used last time and he's put like six different poses in the model. So I went through each one and this is the one that I used in the initial video I did on this process. But like I say, Smedit did the whole conversion for this. All I did was enter in a box size of 160. So they saw roughly the same size. And as you can see, it's done a really great job. Um, but credit where credit is due, Ilsteer is the creator of the actual OBJ model uh, available on the SketchUp warehouse. So put a link in the description for that. And then finally we've got the Beam Saber Gundam with shield. So I think that's all six. And I'm going to be releasing these. These are hollow, hardened, Oh no wait, are they hardened? They might not be. Nope, standard. So it's, these are hollowed and smoothed and they use white. And the challenge is simple. Uh, it's a painting challenge. So I want to see your paint schemes. Obviously in the Gundam community it's all about painting. So I want to see your color schemes. Obviously you can customize the model by adding it or changing it. And I would suggest just using the pose that's closest to the one you want to use. You want to change the weaponry, switch up the colors, bulk out the armor, maybe change it into a different Gundam other than the RX-78. So that's the challenge and I'd love to see people enter into this competition. There is a prize for the winner and I believe we're going to be taking entrance for about two months. So this will run past Christmas now. So uh, uh, basically, yeah, good luck. Can't wait to see what people come out with. Uh, the rare file will contain all six of the cement files that we're looking at right now. And um, the challenge is you can do whatever you want inside the ship and you can customize it however you want outside the ship. But try to remain within the Gundam universe. If you want to change it into a mecha from a different series, that would take a lot more work. But I'd accept that as well. So there you go. If you want to just repaint it in Smedit and leave no alteration, you know, just leave the model as is, that's great. So uh, like I say, those are the models. That is the challenge. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.